Hello dear students, myself Dr. Shrikant Verma, MBBS MD Anatomy, Director Simple Medical Academy. So here we are starting one new chapter of the anatomy that is very interesting. Yes, that is the history of anatomy. Yes, maybe the questions in your PPG exam, it may not be asked from this history of the anatomy. But yes, it is very interesting part because the all the medical science origin and their development that starts from the anatomy that starts from the human body dissection so what is the way how this anatomy developed and all the medical science developed from this anatomy we are going to see this event yes as you know the anatomy means ana plus tommy yes ana means to see tommy means cutting means just cut the structures and see means cutting and the observation yes cutting and the observation means dissection is the anatomy okay yes so earlier very early time when there is the death then yes people we are having lots of interest what are the things within the body so very earlier there is the dissection but yes this dissection was crime who will want to dissect the body of the relatives no nobody so yes, this was very crime. Anatomy was the crime. But as the time was running, the physician, the doctors, all the peoples, they are understanding that till when we will not dissect the body, we cannot properly understand the diseases. So the dissection became very important. So very early, very early, the Herophilus was the physician. Herophilus was the doctor who properly dissected the body and written many many books so yes herophilus is considered as the father of anatomy yes he dissected the body he dissected the brain properly he dissected the git properly yes he was the first doctor first physician first anatomist who told that the center of the soul is not the heart but that is residing within the skull within the cranium yes that is the brain he properly dissected the brain that's why yes we read in the sinuses of the brain there is one topic sinuses of the brain there we read torcula herophili yes torcula herophili is situated here on the posterior part yes torcula herophili is the part where the superior sagittal sinus yes then straight sinus superior sagittal sinus straight sinus right transverse sinus left transverse sinus and the occipital sinus this all meets here means this torcular herophili was studied by the herophilus means he studied about the various sinuses of the brain means yes he was the first person who studied properly the brain dissected the brain and given many concepts written many books that's why this Herophilus is known as the father of anatomy. Yes, Herophilus was the first anatomist who differentiated between the vein, artery and the nerve. Yes, the first year MBBS student, when he enters in the anatomy department, first medical science of the doctors, he learns that how to differentiate between the vein, artery and the nerve. Yes, vein is the tubular structure but collapsible. The artery is tubular structure, but it is having the recoil property. The nerve is tubular and cord-like solid structure. This is the differentiation. This is the first thing which the first year MBBS student must know. Who differentiated? Who told this concept? Herophilus. Yes. That's why Herophilus is known as the father of anatomy. Yes. The duodenum term was coined by the herophilus means he dissected the GIT part also so lots of knowledge about the herophilus that's why he is considered as the author of anatomy we will know about more yes we will know more about the herophilus in the next video so just like share subscribe these videos which are now we will call these videos as the history of the anatomy thank you very much Subscribe our channel and hit the bell icon for notification on our simplified medical and motivational videos.